Hello, my friends. It's World Kindness Day. And Mary thought, what would be the kindest thing for her? And of course, that means coming out to Loxahatchee. I thought, oh, I could lie on my bed and meditate and joy spot from there. But I said, mm, no, I got a joy spot. to one of my favorite joy spots, Loxahatchee. I was enjoying the sunlight coming through the trees, the beautiful moss, and the crickets. So, thanks for being with me as I'm spotting some more joy and sharing it with you. Hold tight, here we go. Okay, if it's purple, you know I'm going to stop. And you can hear the red-shouldered hawk in the distance. We've got big bumblebees enjoying the lovely purple flowers. We have some yellow tucked in. So this would be a field of joy. Purple and yellow together. Bees. Nice breeze. Give me a moment to contemplate what joy I see in everything. The breeze on my neck. Palm fronds rustling in the breeze. Brilliant blue sky. The insects buzzing. Listening to the birds. Watching the dragonflies with the gold glinting on their wings. So this is the kindest thing I can do for myself today. Enjoying the beautiful outdoors. Glad to share it with you. This green shining in the sunlight is just stunning. I had to stop. We've got red-bellied woodpeckers. You can hear that now. I had to share that with you. Look at that. This is a pond. Cypress. The ones that go down, I think. Bald or down. Cypress are... Oh, look, some seeds. Excellent. You can hear the birds. Hi. Okay. Dragonflies dancing. Butterflies. A pair of them dancing. Flew right into my face. It was beautiful. Hopefully you can see the gold glinting. Oh, there goes a great egret. Disturbed at something, but it wasn't me. Oh, here it comes. The dragonflies. Truly a joy. Oh, they're on this side of me now. Gorgeous. Oh, we've got a great blue heron up ahead as well. This one doesn't seem to be very happy about us being near it. Here he comes. That thumping is over at the agricultural area. I'm not sure what they're doing, but their collard greens are already in full bloom. Gorgeous. Makes me want to go get some. 
it is warm, but it is very breezy, thankfully. Oh, there's the breeze. Gorgeous. Another frap just day. So glad to have you with me. Sunlight reflecting on the water. It's diamonds. I'll always catch my eye. to live our life with kindness, we too reflect the light. Recently I've been reciting in my meditation. Kindness we seek, the kindness we share, reflecting gift that we enjoy. Underneath this brilliant blue sky. in the gorgeous places that we inhabit this earth, this world. We have so much we can do for each other in this world. May we never cease. So the light is like this. We know that for Florida, we're definitely in autumn. We know because of the quality of the light, the color of the greenery, and the blue of the sky. We don't get very chill down here. Rarely we'll get uh, what we know is cold snaps, but they don't last very long. But I am looking forward to less humidity as the uh, month of November and December proceed. But not too quickly, please. It's a lovely breeze today. Looks like we do have some fires out in the sugar cane way out there. As you can see that in the clouds. That's definitely remnants of smoke. But here we have the chance to rest. Yes, we do get autumn leaves and autumn colors down here. This is a maple, so it will go. Those beautiful red leaves for us, especially against that sky. What do we notice? me for being out of breath. I was just trotting along and I spied this because I got to look down as I'm putting one foot in front of the other. See if I can not tumble. Let me get that in the center there. Yeah, that shady area is the camera. As we all know, all this area had been under the ocean, the sea. Let's see if we can sharpen the. There you go. So, who knows how long it's been since it was carrying a live creature. I've walked on this path so many times. And I've seen other sea creatures of the fossilized sort, but I had never seen this one. 
So even though I was doing some good trotting, some good breathing, I had to stop for this. Notice. Oops. It's almost as if it uh, could have been uh, crafted through a tool. But of course, creation is its own best artist. I had to share this with you. Of course, that reminds us. Always look up, but don't forget to look down for what we may see. Beautiful. Okay, we got the great white egret. Standing stock still. Hunting. Part my breath. It's almost a statue. See his reflection. Her reflection in the water. Beautiful. for that noise. There is a firing range north of here. I wasn't looking eastward, but look at that beautiful cypress stand and the beautiful sky. And back to our beautiful heron. Take a time to notice, appreciating what is. Feeling the breeze again. Watching the grasses flutter in the breeze. True blessing. True joy. Okay, my friends. I'm on the northern spur of the trail. Oh, sorry. I've been this far north in a while. And blessed to find this beautiful rambling casea, they called it. Look how beautiful those yellows are. Golden almost. I had to share that with you. Of course, <clears throat> this canal filled with, I'm not sure if this is appropriate, because it's completely socked in. Not sure if it's an invasive, I don't see anything blooming, I can't tell what it is, but with so many leaves and uh, plants, the birds will be able to walk all over this as they're hunting. Okay, so it's a very sunny day, it's warm, but hey. I'm out in a joyous place, doing the kindest thing for myself. So I want to thank you for coming along with me. And yes, it wouldn't be Sunday Stroll unless Mary had a red face. So thanks again for being with me. I'll give you another northern view. And the beautiful sky. Until next time. Peace. You know, it wouldn't be a coda. It wouldn't be a video for me without a coda. It's a lovely example of a mollusk. The world. How long it's been here? 
and how long so much on this planet had been here long before humans. And regret, sorry, regrasping and embracing our humility as just one collection of creatures and beings on this planet when there are millions and billions of others who've been here longer than we and who will be here longer than us. But that does not obviate our responsibilities to make good decisions about conservation, regreening, not wasting. Like Mother Teresa said, you can't do all the good in the world, but we can do the good where we are. Whatever little good that may be. Until next time, my friends. May you be well. May you be safe. May you be peace. May you be as healthy as possible. And we'll end with the diamonds. Peace, my friends. <laughs>